Hello everyone, welcome back. And today is the first video of 2023. Woo! Happy New Year! So today I thought we'd kick off the year with a set review. And this is the Goat Ball from Fall of Thunder. So yeah, this set is massive, like it's so long. You know I keep a Home Alone house right here next to me because that's really the only spot. I had to put on the floor just for this video, so you better subscribe. Right. So I've got the box. I've got the build. I've got the minifigures. I've got the two goats at the front. So let's get into it. So I'm going to be starting at the back and working our way to the shack, then to the front, then to the goats. So let's look at the back. So the back has this lovely, very, it's like almost like a little tail just popping up. And it's got two lovely snake pieces right there. Oh, I can't zoom back out. Oh, here we go. Oh, and you can see it says NA21. And when we flip that around, it says NA21. I oh, know, or 221. I don't know. And you've just got a bit of floor space, but then you come to the actual, what I'm calling the shack, which is actually a very interesting build, because as you can see, it just, to get inside it can flip open like that. But let's look inside. As you can see, it's got this, this print there. It says new Asgard. It's got a bottle and this cool shiny thing then when we flip it around to look at the other side we have a fire hydrant which if you didn't know appears in a lot of marvel sets and also a golden staff and that you can see it no doors but it just flips over like that and as you saw in the video it's part of the video it's where i keep mighty fort and what's the villain's name god just sitting up there having a little battle now, as you can see, we've got four stickered shields. So there are eight stickers of these, obviously two of each, because one at each side. So you've got this blue and cream one. You've got the red and blue one, the red and cream one, and the blue and another blue and cream one. Uh, let's see. Would have been cool maybe if... I don't know. I don't know. But as we, and then as we get to the Asgard Tours, or whatever that says... Humid, so somewhat similar on the other side. Yep, Asgard toss. And then before, and then let's quickly talk about the front. As you can see, it is two, two of the same build, just put up like that, and they look like little seahorses. To be honest, as you can see, you do have this clip on the front. Now this is for, this is for fours, hammer. Which is a built hammer, so you can just put that up there. Which I, yeah, which is actually a very, and that's how I display it. But then before, let's, before we look at the two goats, we can flip it, and you can look at the underside. Now, as you can see, it is literally just two, and plates. So when you're building this up, like roundabout, I think it's back four or five. I had, it was very flimicky, like, that part just kept breaking. So I'd, I'd recommend, like, building it on a solid surface. And also, some little detail with the blue suds, as if it's flying. Then we've got two goats, which, as you can see, there's these two, two stickered pieces right there, which then pin, there's a pin, and then you can attach it to the goats. So the goats both have these stickered face, no, printed faces. Which this one's like a silly billy goat. This one's a more serious goat. And then they've both got different horns. This one's more like reminds me of a gazelle horns, where this one reminds me of a... And then both of them have stickers backs on here. And it's honestly it really does remind me of Santa's sleigh. With two animals pulled it and it getting pulled behind. And I presume with those things it can it flies. Alright, should we take a look at the minifigures? I think we should. I'm going to start with a bad guy. His name is Gore. Now, there is quite a lot of weird names for the force. As you can see, we've got this big old sword. <laughs> now we've got no sword on no me. <laughs> but they've got this big old sword 
which you can obviously have a battle with. And this print, the head has back printing, not. And then also, you've got this mummy like claw, mummy like torso, perfect for, well, a mummy custom. And let's go to Gore next. Now, Gore also appears in Bro Asgard set, which I have a review, so I'll leave the link down below. To it. As you can see, he's got this golden like staff thing and he's got this fur. Now, this is a different version. The one in Bro Falls Asgard is a lot more like chillaxed. Whereas this one's got all his weapons on and he's got even a cool little goat thing right there. And he's got this cool molded head and 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 yes there is another first but yeah so yeah and i think that fur piece would be actually perfect for the spider-man villain craven so next i'm gonna say going to this person it's king valkyria i'm gonna presume it's a female, you know, because it looks like a female. I'm not sure with it being called King. So first off, there's this lovely blue cape. And I can think of lot and that'd be so useful. Because obviously I've got red cape, black capes, have you uh believe that's it. I did I did have a yellow cape, but like I kinda look wrong. Broken. So it's really nice to have a blue cape. Plus, because it's displayed with this minifigure, it shouldn't get broken. And you've got this lovely printing, which is obviously like weaponized. And it's a print, you can't really see the back, but it does look like this printing because of this hair piece, which again looks really nice. Like it's that big old long hair piece. Fortunately, oh, and as you can see, you've got a smirking face, and then on the front, you've got a cheese. I'm so happy, cheese. And then you've also got this other little sauce. Next, let's move on to Mighty Four. As you can see, we've got the re the red cape and a hammer. Like this is, um, believe a uh, force hammer, but the uh, yada yada yada. Well, it used to be force hammer. Then we've got this cool like headpiece with hair attached to it. Mighty Four. Uh, let's see. Mighty Four. Go. Go and four of these variants also come in attack on new Asgard, which also will be linked down below. But yeah, as you can see, it's lovely. And then for the first detailing, we've got a mm, first like an angry face, and we've got I'm unimpressed, Ugh. which that unimpressed face is probably really good. Plus, uh, plus yeah, the red cap again, you know, useful. Talking about red capes, we've also got four who also have the red cape. And I, and then we've got this like open sleeved blue arms. So no blue so like and there's so much detailing gone into this. Even detail on the back. We've got this very four hair, which I can which I've actually already used in the custom. I'll put it on the screen of Green's Lumberjack along with a face. I'll link a lot down below to that video too. See, see, he's got a very happy face, but then a very angry face with a thunderbolt and lightning. It's very, very frightening. So, yeah. Well, we've actually... I'm not going to forget this time like I did in the Bro Falls New Asgard. So, and we've got the box. Which, let's, let me just alter my camera angle so we can have a better look. So here we go with the box. Now, if you're wondering, this is where the Home Alone half would usually sit. So, this, uh, you see, it says Marvel Fall of and Wonder, 8 plus 7, 6, 2, 8, which is the set number. The goat, but I am, don't worry, guys, I am definitely over 8. Two. <laughs> and as you can see, we've got the goat bot flying, and we've got all three heroes sitting on the boat. We've got the fourth hammer here. Mighty Four flying off. No sign of gore. And as you can see, I'm not very good with these names. Which is why it's so great to have them down here. We've also got an Avengers logo. Plus Four and Mighty Four. And something I found out recently. You flip to the back of the box. You have the Lego 5 version of Four. 
well, now, to say how I review, as you can see, that's probably where I got inspiration from having them up there, obviously I can't fly, and then I usually have that, Th these, this person like here, that person just standing there and four looking outwards, and you've also got the two goats just wandering, really cool, and it also shows you the button, which yeah. As you can see, he also says big old marvel. So, yeah, that is the goat boat. So, yeah, thanks guys for watching. I'm just gonna, f I've got to put everything back to how it used to be. And, and yeah, I hope you guys have, have you, hope you guys had a good 2022 and let's make it a good 2023.